What's up guys? Just woke up, going to look for my tour. It's like five something in the morning and I'm super goddamn tired, but it's all right. It's totally worth it. Uh, I had breakfast and now I'll let you know when I get to the tourist spot. All right guys, we made it to the bus. Doing pretty good so far this morning. Early wake up calls I mentioned and so far I'm looking forward to the day. Let's see how it goes and uh, today we're going to the Giants calls. So, we just got to Northern Ireland, I'm just on the bus. It's been lots of rolling fields, so got some pictures, but I figured this will look way better than going through a bus window because of the glare. Remember I told you I like different fence designs? This one's even cool, it's very simple. Look, all they've done is they've folded the steel, so, or the metal. It looks like it might even be just stainless. And they've just folded it so it's a couple different Wade spikes. Kind of neat. And then you got a church. It's up on the hill. We're on our way to uh, to suspension bridge, I guess, between two cliffs. So that should be a good, nice one. Check it out, guys. We're now on the top of a viaduct, which is pretty freaking high. But yeah, as you can see, it's overlooking the valley. Pretty sweet. Hey guys, so we made it to the rope bridge. I'm just walking up to it, but let me show you a little bit. Let's see right from here. It's pretty sweet. Man, I'm loving the vibes. Hear the ocean. See the nice greenery. If I hadn't taken the tour, I would have definitely been climbing up there today. But other than that, no, it's pretty sweet. Definitely enjoying the views. Look at this, holy crap. Another nice view. So we're gonna walk across the bridge. Well, that over there is Scotland. That's where I was probably, what, a week ago now? <laughs> Last week. But yeah, overall, great view. I'll show you what I'm looking at right now. Amazing, actually. Well, guys, just finishing up here, and then it's off to the Giants Causeway. The rope bridge is definitely worth seeing. If you get a chance while you're in Ireland, got it. The view is just insane. If I had more time, I would definitely be going down that path and I'd go down to the shore because I think that would be sweet. And if I had a good camera, that would just have to happen. Like if I had like a camera I could do time lapse with, that would be a wicked place to do it. But yeah, see how everything goes going to the causeway. So got to the Giants Causeway. 
8.50 to get in, but apparently if you walk up here, it's a private road, so they have to let you in, so that way you don't have to pay the 8.50, which is what our bus driver said, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> so I'll start filming again once I'm back up on the cliffs. Another nice view. So what I'm going to do is, you see that staircase going down over there? I'm going to walk down to the beach, because I've already seen a lot of the mountains up here. And I really want to go down to the water this time. I'm so glad I came to Ireland. Holy crap. Like, <laughs> that's insane. And like I said, even the greenery in the background. See the whole valley from up here. See what they call it, the Giant's Causeway, but. Oh. This rope bridge, that's a great tour. I mean, you might look at it and say, man, that's 60. Euro, but it gets you into here. Well, not really into here. They just tell you how to get here for free. And then the bridge, it's totally worth it. And then you get to all, I'm also going for an hour in Belfast later, so be good. I'm a little bit closer to the edge than I should probably be. But it's totally worth it. Look at this view. Oh, man. All I'm risking. Right now is a nice glass of whiskey, a cigar, maybe a chocolate bar, maybe a sandwich. I got mountains to my left, I got mountains to my right. And I got the ocean down there. Oh, I want to see if I can zoom in on that island for you. It's pretty sick. Look at the water around it. Like, oh. Wait for it to focus, see if it does. Yeah. There we go. Slow pan. Boom. walking down to the water. Oh, it's just still stunned. It's amazing. Holy crap. Sorry if it's a little bit rocky. I'm just walking on the path right now down. I, of course, want to get like right where those people are over there, right on the edge of the water. Hell, maybe I'll even dunk my head in. We'll see. <laughs>
kind of walked along a little bit. Even these pools look kind of cool. I took a couple photos. Man, holy. I could probably film for hours, but yeah. Absolutely honest. If you told me I died and went to heaven right now, I would probably believe you. The pools, the water crashing. Oh. Yeah, this just made everything way better today. Well, just walking back along the rocks now. I spent like a little bit too long there. I gotta get back to uh, the bus. <laughs> oh well, at least I got to spend the time I wanted to down here. They gave us enough time for lunch, so I was able to spend like an hour down here and just shoot a little bit of footage for you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. But one last look. Last bit for you before I walk through the gate out of here, but oh my gosh. It's fantastic. So I just nailed a sandwich and now I'm on my way to the castle. <laughs> it's the castle. Try and zoom in a bit. We're at Belfast. This is the city hall. 
And that over there is the monument for everyone that died on the Titanic. You can see their names carved kind of on it, but yeah. Yeah, and then you got some pretty neat statues. Here's a quick look at the front end of the building. It's pretty sweet. And then you got Oh, the queen. <laughs> I love it. Looking around the city again, lots and lots of old buildings. I don't have much time here, so I'm still going to wander around and see what I can see. But I got probably like a half hour to an hour. So, just walking down this shopping center. Some pretty cool stores and stuff. It's amazing when you see, like, I don't know, stores that I see at home and they're. Uh, What's the best way to put it? Uh, you know, in these crappier areas, and then they get like full buildings like this when they get here, like old school buildings. I think it was like back there. I also seen like a McDonald's in like this insanely cool old building. And it's just something you don't see usually. But yeah, I'm just gonna continue wandering around. There's another cool looking building. It's got the big clock in it. And then this one also looks kind of neat. So I picked up one of these city sightseeing uh, things and I always pick it up from this company. The only reason why is if you open it up, it usually tells you and gives you a pretty good map of where the main attractions are. And usually when you look at these, there's a lot of uh, big pictures of the stuff that you want to see before you go. I was laughing because they've got like nothing here. The only one that I've really seen is the Parliament Building and the Titanic Tour of course because there's some kind of cool stuff that's on there usually. But yeah, that's about it. I mean, I was trying to see if I could find where the cathedral was but it's not really listed on here either. Another cool looking building. It's funny, as I was showing you guys the map, the guy, one of the guys who actually works for this company was walking up to me and says, hey, do you need a hand? See, like, they're a really good company. If you're looking for a hop-on, hop-off company, it's pretty sweet. Because then you can hop off of the stuff you actually want to see. Because there's a lot, you know, that's the problem with the tour, regular tour, if you're stuck on the bus and you actually want to take a picture of something, well, not on the bus, then yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna see if I can find this computer. It's more of the wicked graffiti covers that I've seen from the other place too. Check this one out, guys. Like I said, some of them are just wicked. There you go, guys. I found the cathedral I was looking for. I seen on the way in. Pretty sweet. By the way, I also found an SUV I'd be, actually drive around. Look at that. Finally found my first gas guzzler. Even then, it's probably got a smaller engine. But yeah. It's cool. <laughs> See what I mean? You got the Disney store and like some old building, and same with KFC. It's kind of funny. Just walked into City Hall and checking it out. 1914, holy. Pretty cool looking. There you go, guys. Sun's slowly going down. Dinner is served. Hey guys, how's it going? So, as you can see, I had a burger at that Lebanese place, which ended up being really good. I totally recommend it. So, I hope you guys see how awesome Ireland is from the uh, footage that I posted. And we'll uh, go from there. I think I'm just going to go back to my hostel now, do some uh, editing, and then from there, 
just going to relax because I got another early morning for another tour tomorrow and it should be another really good one so stay tuned live long and prosper mother truckers and don't die on me